and welcome to a new week on iRacing. We've got Iowa here today. USF 2000. It's been a minute since I've raced this thing, and uh, we're here at an oval. And an oval I've never actually been to before in this car. So this ought to be interesting. Yeah, uh, I'm not quite sure what to expect out of the racing here. Unfortunately, the oval races seem to miss more often than not in the USF 2000. This place seems kind of big for uh, for this poor thing. <laughs> but, uh, you know, we'll see what we can get out of it. Um, I don't even know what qualifying is going to look like here. I guess we'll just go around the bottom. What else to expect? I don't know. I'm kind of wondering, like, I don't know, maybe you can, like, shift to fifth and it'll be better. Kind of looking like you just kind of wrapped the bottom, to be honest. P2. P2 right now. Shortest way around. I mean, it's so underpowered. We'll use third or fifth gear for a second. I don't know if that was better or not, but probably not. But doing the job enough, I guess, for right now. P2. But I don't know what the actual racing is going to look like. I imagine with draft, we're going to be in sixth gear. Probably not even thinking about fifth gear. Maybe it'll get tighter later on. I have no idea. Lots of unknowns heading into this one. I did want the track position though, so I'm glad that it seems like we're doing okay-ish there. Like, you can kind of try to keep your wheel straighter on exit, but I really think you just are better off keeping it down here, close to the yellow line. Oh, we're dropping. Okay, I guess people waited to do qualifying. Maybe burn some fuel off before they tried their lap? You guys just stay in six. Good question. That's the guy that's on pole asking that, so... I don't know why he's wondering. Because he apparently has it figured out already. We're not going to use brake at any point. So none of this matters. I mean, the only thing we can change is the brake bias. So, uh, I guess we'll roll off P4. Not too surprising we are the number one car. Um, next highest. Wow, listen to that. Everyone's just burning their fuel. I guess that's just what you gotta do, huh? Make the thing lighter. That seems kind of silly. This all can't say it kind of seems a little silly. But <laughs> this is like the first thing going off this week. And, uh... It was USF 2000 on oval, and an oval I haven't tried yet, so I figured I'd give it a look. I think the lap times are only going to get faster as the car gets lighter. I'll burn a little fuel, sure. I'm not going to sit here and blow my engine like these guys are trying to do. <laughs> but, seems kind of silly. Here I'm going crazy around us. Two guys in front aren't even out here yet. But they got to grid up soonish, about 30 seconds. Here they're starting to show up. Aerotite, always a pretty big thing. In these cars. So we'll see if we can avoid that, maybe avoid wearing the tires any more than we need to. You're on the outside this time. Pit road is closed right now. I wonder what gear we're going to want to start in. Interesting. Two to green. Kind of thinking it might be a uh, second gear start. Because it looks like we would need to shift really quick. Hopefully the racing's not too bad. Like I said, a lot of the times, a lot of times the racing on ovals in these cars isn't that great. These cars are so underpowered. 
Maybe we do for the first gear. Man, I was ready. I see two to green. <laughs> One left to green. Yeah, you gotta pay attention. And maybe we will do first gear. I was paying enough attention to notice the pace car stayed on the track. I didn't run into anybody, but still. I guess uh, road only racers aren't quite used to having multiple pace laps. Generally, right? I don't think there's any road courses you would normally do that. I think we might actually do first gear start. Didn't get much practice. I kind of made a late decision to try this out. So hopefully there's nothing too crazy that I experienced for the first time. About to go green. Stay focused. But we'll just try to have some fun. Okay, first gear worked just fine. Inside. Keep high. Clear inside. Inside. Sixth gear. Clear inside. Stay high. Here's someone coming to my inside really close. Oh boy. It's already a little so weird. Still there at the bottom. Oh boy, they're like three wide. With the car on the low side. Car inside. Still there. Uh oh, this is like pack racing, isn't it? We're doing pack Still racing here today. That guy nearly killed me. We're not gonna survive this race, I don't think. Kind of having that look to it. This is super speedway racing. Iowa super speedway. Clear inside. Inside. Everyone's kind of just hugging the bottom. It looks like. Oh my god, where is that guy going? Outside is clear. What was that? Why is he down on the apron? Clear inside. And we've fallen all the way back, but I don't think it matters. Kind of just wanted to get out of the big mess. No cautions in this series, of course. Interesting. No one's uh, wrecked yet, so that's good. Did I speak too soon? I don't think tires are even going to be a thing. It doesn't seem like there's any kind of change with handling happening, even with potential aero push. There's nothing really going on there. I don't know if I would ever do this again, but hey, let's make the most of it while we're here, I suppose. Oh my gosh, that guy is weaving up there. Last. So I've heard. Gee whiz, if I finish last, I lose 154 I rating. What am I doing here? <laughs> Clear. According to Race Lab, that's what it said anyway. 
Inside. That's like a freaking week of decent finishes. Still there, inside. Clear inside. I try not to care too much about it, but I like numbers. I would be very sad if my number bankrupted. Why is he blocking? That's so annoying. Not necessary at all. Inside. Clear inside. Inside. Clear inside. Inside. Oh. Clear inside. That was about as close as it gets. Tenth position. That's unfortunate for that guy. Not really quite sure what happened. I saw some contact. It's a bit snoozy out here. That guy is not going to be able to come to make his way back up. He just doesn't have draft anymore at Iowa Super Speedway. They need to stop turning these good tracks into Super Speedways, man. First Atlanta, now this. Outside. Outside is clear. Maybe I just keep it uh, in fifth. Just make sure I don't blow up and I can burn some more fuel off and be faster. That's a theory. Just keep an eye on my temps. There's just like no point to any of this racing right now. Like, there's nothing, it doesn't mean anything. It's just gonna... You know, someone's always gonna be on your rear end. Even if you get around them right now. You're not gonna be able to go anywhere. I guess we'll burn fuel off and just hang out back here. You've just done a 23.4. Hopefully if they wreck we can get around and stay in the draft without getting into it. Kinda sucks because we'll have to basically no lift if there's a wreck. still seem fine. <sighs> well, at least I, uh, I'll try this once. I was kind of like, man, I know Iowa, you can kind of like run low, run high, but this car is just way too slow. Doesn't matter. It's low line or nothing. Halfway through it though. Watch the temperatures down there. They're still good. Potentially burning more fuel out, I guess. I don't even know if it works that way. Let's see, 71 RPM. If we go to 6th. So that'll be faster. That lap time was 23.4. Hmm. And we'll just keep burning more fuel, I guess. I don't know if that's going to make any difference at all. But something to do right now while we're just waiting for the race to be over.
<laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> Just here, like, hitting the chip. It's going, hanging on to the back of this pack. Waiting for guys to bump tires and cause a big wreck in front of us. That's pretty much what we're waiting for. Time was 23.4. We just start trying to get track position ever. They look like they're about to run into each other. Maybe we see if we can get down on that low line or something. Outside. Nothing. Like we're just stuck here now. What's the point? Still there. Hold your line. Clear. P nine. We can kind of shift to fifth. Maybe get a little bit more pull out of the corner. Go uh, second lane. Sure. Why not? Inside. Inside. Wowie. Still inside. Clear. Car inside. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Stay high. I'm the third of it now. Clear. Inside. Still there at the bottom. Clear inside. Inside. Stay high. Are we there yet? Still inside. Still there at the bottom. Still there inside. You're up top three wide. Inside. Two wide. Still there. <laughs> yeah, I'll try to make it three wide, I guess. Car inside. It must be no good. There's not like anything you can ever do with that. Still there at the bottom. This is really dumb. <laughs> Got ten left to go. Position clear inside. Time was at twenty-three point five. At least we're not the number three, I guess. Like, what am I? What do we even? How can you even do anything? There's nothing you can do. I was tricked into, a, into doing a super speedway race today, and I'm not happy. Outside. Still there. Go low. Go low. There's nothing. There's nothing I can do. Outside. I guess I could try for a mega run. Like, start from way back and just get a huge bonsai run. <laughs> try to go around some guys. I don't know. We'll see how that works out for us. It won't. Well, let's see. Look at me go. I mean, like, I just, you get stalled out. There's nothing left to do here. End of the road. This is the worst. Oh my god. Since we went more three, but... Still 
still there. Come on, Colter. Push, push, push. We can catch this car. Clear. This is terrible. Like, what do I do now? There's nothing I can do. It doesn't matter what I do. Two left to go. Two to go. Two laps left. That last lap was at 23.5. Kink is closing the gap. It's now 10 seconds. Car outside. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Still hold, last lap, outside, too wide. Still there, hold your Slap, line. I guess. Stay low, there is a car on the high Eight side. Place. White flag, last lap. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Still there, hold your line. This is stupid. <laughs> that was so stupid. the end of the race. Never mind. That was really chicken boring. Flag, chicken flag. Yeah, run this track in the day. Work. It's a lot better. You can get the Apex and actually live. Holy fuck, that was boring. Yeah, that was just... I don't even know. It was... Uh, interesting. Like, yeah, good for, you know, good close racing. Everyone kept it clean. Really good job, everyone. But yeah, that's just kind of boring is the right word, but definitely a thing. <laughs> you just can't do anything. Street stock from Charlotte. <laughs> I'd much rather be lifting into the turns and, and have a spread out field than, than just that. Like you couldn't even pass. Yeah, that was terrible. I tried it, and then I think it was the four shot it also, and it just, you just could not get that up on going. Nothing happened. Yeah, Literally yeah, nothing happened. about 20 laps to, to make a pass there. <laughs> yeah, Brian, you... you, you well, we lose 100 and freaking something I rating because I signed up for this, I guess. That was just uh, one of the worst things I've ever done on iRacing. If you and timed it just right, that would have been my only chance. But as long as there was someone on your tail, that I was never going to get to the lead out there. All right. Uh, yeah, here are the uh, yeah, good results. Race, yeah. 23, 38 strength guys. of field. We lose 118 freaking I rating. <laughs> Nothing happened. Oh, for sure. But before the race started, I'm That's it. See ya, I guess.